we engaged with a group of people to understand their perspective on individuals working in engineering fields. What comes to your mind when you hear the word an engineer? Somebody who can hold a lot of uh, data and information in, the, in their minds. He is doing a lot of calculations. He builds machine. He's someone who will go and build the bridges for you. Probably a man who has a cap on uh, with a pencil or a, or a pen in his hand. He should be a genuine person with real, real focus on what I'm doing now, where will it lead to? He should have strong mental strength. If someone is facing any problems, so he needs to address that. He comes into the picture and makes your picture into reality. Can you describe a welder in a couple of lines? He's, he's physically very strong, is what I can think of. A guy with an overall suit, helmet and his uh, welding shield. A very skilled man, tough man, having his diodes and electrodes in front of him and kind of raising sparks and doing the welding. In our discussions, most of you used he to describe an engineer. Now we would like you to meet some of the engineers and technicians working at Godrej and Boys. Eric David, the players of us to me to see all this ordinary woman coming walking in. For me, I thought of a male perspective only in the start, but there should be more women coming forward for this job. I mean, for me, it was an amazing uh, feeling to see so many females, like you guys, working in jobs which intuitively you think are male dominated. I'm not sure if these women know that they are the role model for so many women. They are inspiring so many girls out there. It came to the real sunrise. I never expected a way to be a woman here. I never thought I can see so many women uh, doing this job in male dominated uh, society. My perception has changed that mechanical engineer can be both a male and as well as a female. We still are not able to break stereotypes when it comes to jobs. We need to break our mental bias about what kind of a job a lady can do. Though not intentionally, but intuitionally, I did use he and him a lot many times. But I think a uh, takeaway for me today is I'll be more conscious ahead. Thank you for being in the practice. Thanks a lot. <laughs>